Good morning, friends. This is an advanced Gboard special symbols tutorial. I've gotten some comments recently. How do I make a theta symbol, for example, in math? Well, let's bring up Gboard. First of all, the best virtual keyboard for Android. Check out my tutorial on flow typing, for example. Um, but today, let's take a deeper dive into the virtual keyboard. If you want numbers and symbols, tap the number key there, and you can see you've got your numerals and special symbols, and the mathematical operators here as well give you additional symbols, friends, including pi, and you can see you've got square root, as well as currency symbols, brackets, and you've got a delta symbol there, but say we want to go deeper. What we want to do is add languages, particularly Greek for math. Click on the gear icon, and I'll open the settings to Gboard. And then let's head down to languages right there. And you can see US is the default for me. Your language may vary. And add keyboard, friends, right down here. Add keyboard, see that? The glare is spread down to the Greek language here. And Cyprus is a more ancient form of Greek, apparently. So let's go with that. I believe the theta symbols are the same regardless. Try to obscure this glare so you can see the word Greek down there. Well, anyhow, that says Greek. My apologies for the glare. And then we can see this right here. Okay. So let's hit the back symbol and go back to our app, our note-taking app here. And then let's cruise down here and theta. And then hold the, now you see English, the word English appears on the space bar. Hold the space bar for a second. And now you'll see your languages that, your keyboards that you've installed. So let's select the Cyprus Greek language and there you can see your Greek characters here friends and I'll bring you a little closer here so you can see there's theta number seven and pi is zero so our theta symbol is the seven character right there you can see very nice let's bring this up no glare theta beautiful and you can do this for all languages you're interested in. If you want to use any type of language, you can vary with your keyboards. Let's um, get out of Greek right now and go back to English. And we're back to English. Please subscribe to my channel because I'm always posting something different here on the channel. And post your comments below. I enjoy reading good comments. And thanks for tuning in, friends.